Hello everyone and welcome back to Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. Don't we have to go outside? Yes, we do have to go touch grass, Ron. So now our f lesson is to go to Hagrid and do Care of Magical Creatures. <coughs> Which should be fun. Last episode we got Neville out of that Muggle Studies place. Hey, Circa Duggan. Last one. Skavika. Okay, really? I... Indeed, it takes one to know one. <laughs> I just wanted to see what he said because, of course, he got replaced because the um, the fat lady um, ran away last time because she got attacked by Sirius Black, and Peeves showed up. Really, they should have added Peeves to the movies, like. It's it's almost like not adding Dobby to the movies. Probably, actually, <laughs> you could argue that Peeves is even more important than Dobby. Hello there. Hey, did you hear that Hagrid's teaching care of magical creatures this year? Yes. It seems there's no trading of famous witches or wizards cards in this game. Which, you know... It was kind of fun in the last game. It really does seem the last game was bigger than this game. Like, the Chamber of Secrets was is bigger than the Prisoner of Azkaban. Because there really is just, like, most of Hogwarts is just shut off in this game. Well, I don't know about most of Hogwarts, but when you go to the bottom floor, you can definitely tell. Anyone who goes wandering off. So watch yourself. The staircase. Well, let's keep an eye out in the um, the entrance Here hall. We go now. This is certainly is not the entrance hall, but look at those shadows. Entrance hall. Okay, so we have to look around here and try and find something. Because there's a, some sort of collectible, or maybe not collect, like the thing for upstairs, um, for the notice board. Because the notice board has items. You collect the item and you take it back. I'm sorry to say it. But all that studying you're doing can't be healthy. If you're not careful, your brain's going to burst, you know? I appreciate your concern, Ron. I think. He's not wrong. Why don't you run along to that oaf Hagrid? He's gonna need all the help he can get. Why aren't we going outside? <laughs> Maybe they're behind these. Like, the, it says there's something in the entrance hall. There it is! What actually is it? It's a cr it's a shield. Okay. So I gotta remember to do that. Take it back up. Come on, let's go. When we next go up the stairs, I'll just put it up there anyway. Cracking open a cold one with the boys. Interesting. This courtyard is more similar to the Order of the Phoenix version, it looks like. Um, but you can't go in the middle. That's how peculiar. Oh, it is. It. This is definitely more like the movie, isn't it? Because this is where the guy is sharpening his axe. He's like sat around here and he's just sharpening his axe. Because it's implied that he's the executor for Bookbeak. Oh, what is that? It looks like a fire, but it... I guess it, maybe it's like a quest marker or something. That is weird. That orange thing over there. Hey, Bean. <laughs> Are you talking? Are you talking? I don't think they might pick you up talking there. Um, what else? I just want to have a little gander. Famous bridge. Not that famous bridge. The other famous bridge. And then this is where Hermione punches Malfoy in the face. <laughs> yeah, it's like right here. 
Oh, nice one, Hermione. He deserved it. It's raining! Ooh. I do like a bit of rain in my video games. Maybe, um... Ooh. I wanted to make an ambience video for the Order of the Phoenix. At the Owlery. <gasps> Play Owl Racing. What? I don't remember Owl Racing. Owl Racing? What? Let's see what this entails. Wait, what? Uh, maybe I wasn't actually meant to do that. Wait. Oh, over here. Hello, Hedwig. Oh, I get to pick my owl too? Press circle in time with the owl's wings to fly faster. What does that mean? Oh my god, it failed me instantly. <laughs> because I, I landed. Okay, let's try that again. Press circle in time with the owl's wings. So if I just spam circle... Okay, maybe not. We'll figure this out. So can I actually just pick my owl? Because I was this golden one. If I go over here... Okay, yeah, I do. I pick my owl. I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing here. Okay, I think I need to do it more frequently. Almost like Quidditch. Oh, okay, so I have time to go through each one. Okay, it says press, it means hold. Um, and then let go, I think. Okay, this is confusing. I'm, I'm really not sure. Because they're overtaking me. But if I spam circle, it's not good enough. No, I really don't get this. I mean, I'm, I'm doing it. I'm doing better than I just did, but um, I'm definitely in last place. Oh, I did just overtake, though. Circle in... I'm sure I'd be in first place if I could figure out what I'm doing. Because it's definitely not tapping. If you just tap circle, you'll just fall. And if you hold circle, it's not enough. You'll just fall behind. I think. Yeah. So I'm pressing it a little faster than holding it and a little slower than tapping it. And I think... Oh, this... Okay, I think I might just be getting the hang of it. I can't tell if I am definitely meant to be very far ahead. Oh! Oh, no. <laughs> I'm getting shredded here. Oh! No, I'm such an NPC! Come on. I need to get ahead, but I can't. Oh. Oh my god, this is so hard. I feel like I'm going to get overtaken, and I probably am. This is a very long track as well. No! Keep away! Oh no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, this is a tight turn. Ugh, okay. And they, of course, the controls are inverted. So it's... 
Oh goodness. Where is the next one? It's down there. Come on. Oh. <laughs> no, go away. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is actually really difficult. I'm like try harding so hard right now. No, no, uh oh, uh oh, oh god, and it's GG, it's GG, yep, you miss one and you're screwed and you can't go back, you're in last place, there's literally nothing to do, <laughs> you can't miss any, oh, oh damn it. I'm not really going to try it again. I'm kind of just going to try and see if I can get ahead instantly. Oh, that is actually a terrible place to start. You have to do such a tight turn. How are they doing that? Okay. See, tapping circle, it's like spazzing out a bit. Maybe I can actually just do it by just spamming circle. Because I am. No, it's definitely not how you do it. Oh my god, these NPCs are so much better. As you can see, my wings compared to theirs. But if you just... If you hold it, you... Oh my god, this is so difficult. How are they doing this? And then it's kind of delayed as well. Like, click it... Pressing circle does nothing. You can't just press circle. And just press... I'm going to land because I'm not going to win this. I'll come back to that later, so I'm not just going to waste, like, all my time trying this really difficult owl racing. Damn, that is tough. I've tried everything. I've tried tapping. I've tried holding. I've tried tapping slightly faster. I've tried holding faster. So you hold, let go, hold, like, hold, 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 hold. Tapping doesn't do anything. I kind of want to do it again. Press circle in time with the owl's wings. That is just fucking awful wording. How are they... What the hell is going on? How are they just doing this? Okay, hold. 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 So as soon as his wings go back up, hold, which is instantly. So the second I let go of circle, so I need to hold circle, but the second I let go, I need to hold it again. Nope, I'm just getting shredded. I don't get it. <laughs> it's kind of stressful. All right, I'm done. I'm done with the owl racing. Land in the water, will you? <laughs> Alright, well, that's just not happening. Okay. Well, let's go to Hagrid's. Oh, no way it does a loading screen just for exiting Owl Racing. Alright. Man, that was really difficult. And I still couldn't beat it, so that's going to be something for later. But I'm really eager just to try and get it done, but... There's something about it. What's this? Oh, Hagrid's over there. Something's over there, what is that? There's lots of things. Something over there, and then Hagrid's over there. I assume I'm meant to go to Hagrid. So I'm just going to go to Hagrid. Hello, Urbidi.
G up there. Meet Buckbeak. Buckbeak. isn't he? Yes. Now, the first thing you gotta know about hippogriffs is they're proud. You always wait for a hippogriff to make the first move. It's polite, see? You walk towards him and you bow and you wait. If he bows back, you're allowed to touch him. Harry, Ron, Hermione, who wants to go first? Oh God, if owl racing, if riding Buckbeak is anything like owl racing, I am screwed. <sighs> Hello, Buckbeak. I shall not move. I'm going to move. Go on, climb onto his back. Well done. I expect you'd like to fly him. Bats! Catch as many as you can. You'll need to give Beaky a bit of a run before he can get airborne. Then just fly at the bats and Beaky will do the rest. Go on then. Oh my god. To run. Nice. Oh god. So I just need to run and then he'll take off by himself. Okay, and then the controls it. Nope. <laughs> Why is he falling? Okay. This is. Okay. This isn't just as simple as doing it. And I can't turn him. Why isn't he turning properly? Why isn't he just turning? Turn, Bookbeak. And you can't really turn the camera either. Does he need to run? And then he'll jump up himself. Are you gonna jump, Bookbeak? Okay, you need to press circle. It doesn't tell you that you need to press circle to flap his wings. Why doesn't it just tell you that? Well, you can't land on the floor, so that I okay. Well, that, that actually helps. Okay. Well, that's all my time wasted, so I probably failed. So there were some bats over here. Nope, don't fall. Okay, I can just hold circle, maybe. Uh, where are the bats? There they are. Okay, so you just have to fly through those bats a bunch. The controls are so finicky. It's unbelievable how finicky the controls are. That didn't eat any? Okay, well I've failed this lesson. <laughs> Bookbeak, just eat the damn bats. <sighs> Epic fail. I, uh, to be honest, I mean, okay. It's fine. Oh, six left. Try that again then. Good effort. I'll give you a B, but I'm sure you could do better. Where I don't good get to work. Okay. Give me a go at that thing. This will be easy. You're not dangerous at all, are you? You ugly great brute. Malfoy, no! Oh. Oh. You're not dying, it's just a scratch. His but a flesh wound. <sighs> that is <laughs> compared to the movie Harry that was. made his way to the Quidditch match, unaware that events that day would take an even worse turn.
As the Gryffindor team struggled against the weather, Harry caught sight of a giant black dog high in the stands. An eerie silence fell across the stadium, and a horribly familiar wave of cold swept over him. Dementors swarmed over the pitch, and with his mother's screams ringing in his ears, Harry fell from his broom and knew no more. Damn. All that because I failed, JK. Harry slept restlessly in the hospital wing, sinking into dreams Ooh. full of clammy, rotted hands and petrified clean. Uh. He could hear voices whispering, but they made no sense whatsoever. It's free real estate. Ron? Quiet. I know where Sirius Black is. He's down in the dungeons. Why don't you go tell Dumbledore, you idiot? Follow me. Bullshit. Ron? This is so Ron would never do this. He's too much of a pussy. And I definitely can't like maybe there's a spell later where I can do something with I this better stuff. follow Ron. Better I I should also save. Because of course this game is notorious for crashing. Oh, so I wonder if I can go do the book beak thing again. Because like I didn't want to fail like that. I want to actually pass it. And not only do I want to pass it, I also want to pass the owl racing, which is just seems to be difficult. We're owl exterminators. <sighs> Maybe I'll have to look up the strategy for the owl racing. Black deeds. Oh no, maybe I really can't do the book beak thing again. That kind of sucked because I, I just, I mean, is there any repercussion to not getting a higher grade? Is there anything you get for getting a higher grade? Maybe we'll find out. We're owl exterminators. Take that. <laughs> Peeves. Oh no. Run away. What is that? Nothing. You're starting to panic. I think I know why. Get me out oh my of god. Here. Everything's moving. Your secret's not safe now. I'm in on the joke. <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh god, okay. What? Why is it locking onto those? Well, I need Ron for that, because I don't have that spell. Peeves is such a troll. Ron, can I actually help you? I can. Oh, I am taking his health off. Peeves is such a troll. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah, you imbecile. Why does it keep locking onto those little cauldron things? Leave me alone, you oh. oh my god, the lock on is awful. <laughs> I need to wait till he's back there. Okay, I don't need It sounds like it sounds like football chants. Ron, about Sirius Black. He's in the dungeon. Come on! Maybe Peeves was trying to save me because Ron's being a bit sus. 
Ron, I actually need you though for this. Also, where the hell am I? I have to follow Ron. And why does it lock onto this? There's a few of those. There's one over there as well. Did I just see something move? No. Can see anything over there? No, locked door. Okay. Study area. <laughs> Run sauce. There's something behind here. There's someone prowling around here. Ah, books. Just run away. I don't need to fight them. Hey, there's a little mouse hole there as well. Okay, run away. <gasps> oh, that was close. Hello, Bean. Oh, lovely girl. Hey, lovely Bean. Where is this? The dungeons? Troll in the dungeons. Troll in the dungeons. Damn. See, there's one up there as well. I didn't used to be able to target those. Oh, my little bean. You get the pity pets. Oh, you're so cute. Of course, I have my cats with me. My cats are always with me. Ron, you're acting very sus. But I will follow you anyway. Because this is how it be. I don't remember those shaking in the past either. I've got to stop Ron from finding Sirius Black. What the hell is this? It looks like a gnome. Oh, it's um, a Quidditch player. Weird. Let me check the house points. Slytherin is on 182. What are we on? 200. Nice. We're beating Slytherin still. I have to follow Ron. Ron, what are you doing? We can't take on Sirius Black on our own. You fool, I am serious, Black. Come on! I'm just using a polyjuice potion, aren't I? Avoid being seen. Or avoid being seen, as Adam Cat says. For some reason Adam Cat says seen. Uh okay. Whoa! Where? Is that where I'm actually even meant to go? Potions classroom. I can go in here. Why does it have? A, why doesn't it have a lock on the door? Am I meant to be in here? Uh. Why does it just let me in here? Oh, there's a chest. Yeah. Yeah. A law page. I wonder who we got. Let's have a look. Maybe it'll show us the future. A chispurfle. Chispurfles are parasites that are attracted to magic. Their carapaces are used as ingredients in certain portions, but are particularly difficult to split open. That sounds annoying. Anything else? Nope. I'm going to save again. I have to just save regularly again, as I say, because the game just likes to crash a lot. Black Deeds. Hmm. There's a lot I'm wondering about this game. A lot. A few things that have happened now. Like, I'm thinking about the, the book beak situation where I didn't get an A. Or is it an something else? An O? I don't know. 
an awe for outstanding. Yeah, that's how it is in Harry Potter, isn't it? And awe is the highest grade. Awe for outstanding. And then the owl racing. I'm really worried it's going to crash. Okay. Well, he's not an issue. <gasps> oh my god, I didn't even see him! You're being so sauce. Look, we've got to get Professor Dumbledore. Will you on. shut up? He's in the corner. Go on. Ron is definitely sauce. He gave me that side eye. <gasps> Damn it. <laughs> Ron? I knew it. Oh, I didn't know it was Pony Malfoy, though. I think we're even now. True, we are even. Perhaps I might mention that I saw Sirius Black drag you off into the night. Good night. <laughs> Ron, how did you know where I was? Get wrecked. Jeeves, he couldn't wait to tell someone what Draco was up to. Ah, I brought your stuff, including the Marauder's map. Nice. I knew Peeves was onto something as well. <laughs> Pog. But Malfoy does have a point. Like, we did kind of screw him so he could screw us. Why are we just... What the hell? Where the That's hell the are we? That's the map route out of here. What? Oh, I have to switch to Ron and it'll probably be a secret There's door a on it. Marked yeah. on the map, but I'm not sure how to get into it. That's done it! Because only Ron can open these secrets. Oh my god. Now we're playing Lord of the Rings. Wait, Malfoy actually pushed us down there? Oh, what? They threw stick bombs. There. Uh-oh, stinky. Stinky boo. Oh god, these stink bombs are more annoying than the... is joining me. Come here, little bean. I have to give her a second. Okay, I'll give you a second while I'm angled towards you so you can sit on my legs. Are you struggling a bit, bean? Oh, God. It's fine. Just drop down, Ron. Ron, drop down. What the? That's not... Okay. What the... F okay. Do you... Do you really... Maybe I should switch to Harry so you can see the mini map. Hi, Bean. Okay, you're back to just cleaning yourself. Okay, she doesn't want to sit on my lap. Well, I think she does, but she's just being awkward. What is this? There is chests here, and there is a Hedwig thing. Any famous witches or wizards cards? Hmm? Hmm? Yeah! I knew it! I didn't know it. I hoped it, though. I manifested it. What is this? A grape horn horn? A grap horn horn? I don't remember killing a grap horn. 
Let me look up what a grap horn is, because I don't remember killing one of those for its horn. It's showing them in Hogwarts Legacy. Azkaban. Hmm. Well, they're in Hogwarts. Alright. Whoops, not wrong one. Um... Vampires. I unlocked a vampire. Sir Herbert Varney, 1858 to 1889, short-lived by undead standards, Victorian vampire who preyed upon women in London during the 1880s. I'm sure this is based off a real thing. Was subsequently captured and killed by a special squad from the Department of the Regulation and Control of Magical Creatures. Oh! Is this Jack the Ripper? <laughs> Maybe it's not. Hang on, let me look up. When was Jack the Ripper alive? 1888. Hey, it could be based off of Jack the Ripper, to be honest. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Alright, who else? What else do we get here? Right. Okay, we got the owl treat. Come along, Hedwig. Hedwig. I need you. But I don't know why. Hedwig, the barn owl. Because <laughs> for some reason they call him a barn owl, even though he's very clearly a snowy owl. A snow owl, a snowy owl, snow owl, snowy owl. Fetch Hermione. Fetch Hermione. What the hell do you mean, fetch Hermione? Maybe I'm meant to know what's supposed to happen before I go through here. Go up the stairs. What stairs? I think something's wrong. Oh, wait, actually fetch her. Okay, wait, up here maybe? No, I doubt it, but let's try and go up here, see what's up here. Hermione. I can't. Maybe I need to go backwards? What? What do you mean fetch Hermione? Why does it ever tell you what to do in these old games? What are you doing, Hedwig? You need to go up the stairs. I'm these stairs? Probably not, but I'm going up them anywhere. I mean, it's letting me, so... There we go. Okay, well... <sighs> I think someone's coming. <coughs> Hermione! What on earth did you come down here for, Harry? You should still be in the hospital wing. Long story. And one that involves Malfoy and Polyjuice Potion. At least Peeves was on our side. Well, let's hurry up and get out of here. Okay, well, we can finally use this thing to let Hermione through. Since, for some reason, only Hermione can crawl. <gasps> Hermione, can you squeeze under the door? Okay, so I need something to press that button. I think we've got to get to that switch. Does Hermione have anything cool? Oh, she does. She has the glacier. She has the freezing spell, which extinguishes fires. <laughs> Okay. I need to repair off of this bridge, I guess. Just 
Can this bridge be repaired? No, it doesn't look like it. Or something now it's frozen. I probably can, but it's like being weird. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't realize they wave their boats at you. <laughs> They're just trolling. They're just doing a bit of trolling. Beam for hitting this thing. What the hell? I probably did as well, and there's more of them around, but I, I'm not going back to get them. Because it's not just worth a bean. Beans, what the fuck? <laughs> Why so smug? Hermione, what are you being smug for? You almost just died. Okay, now it probably allows me to yeet! Nope. Uh oh. Oh, okay. Um, is it bugged? It still says X to drop down. I'm gonna save. Oh, never mind. It's just disappeared now. Uh, what the heck? Um,. I'm going to save on the second slot because I feel like, I don't know, it's just not letting me jump off and I'm a little bit worried now. My little kitty cat, she keeps like putting a foot on me and stepping off and I don't know why. Are you just like worried about something? You can sit on me as much as you like, Bean. You can't sit on my laptop though, that's the one thing you can't sit on. But you can sit on my, my knees and my legs. Oh, my poor little Bean. What are you a little bit nervous for? Excuse me, though, because <laughs> you're right in front of my screen. Okay. Um, I can't get up there. Why? Oh, no. What's happening? If I... Is the game, like, bugged out? Because when I hopped down here, it kept showing the prompt for X to jump down, and now I can't seem to, like do anything. Um. Oh no. Cast the pendant on crates to get past them. Like this? Do I need to do it again? Oh, okay. Phew. I was really worried it had bugged out for a second. A spell, another spell for Hermione. It's Hermione's second new spell. Technically third, maybe, I don't know. Bonk. Got it. The Reparo spell book. Nice. Oculus Reparo. Mending charm that fixes broken objects. Okay. And now we repair this box. Oops. Uh, no. uh. 
Wait a second. Oh. Bring it back. Now let go. Okay. Easy enough. So now I just have to go back. What? Drop down, Hermione. All right. What's this door? Anything? Nope. The, oh no. There are those jiggly punk things. I think they're called jiggly punks. They're over there. They're so annoying. You only get one bean at a time out of these? Uh oh. I definitely can't repair this. Nope. Just checking. I need several spell. Why is it making me just constantly switch spells like this? Honestly, I think, like, I don't know, I don't remember much of any of this stuff, or any of much of any of this game. Maybe I didn't get very far on it as a kid. I need Lumos for those guys, don't I? Yeah, I do. I can't beat them without Lumos. But I will take this chest. Good! Good! Let's see. Maybe I meant to go back to Hermione. Uh, to Ron. Who do I like? <sighs> A red cap. These dwarf like creatures live in halls and old battlegrounds or wherever human blood has been spilled. Although easily repelled by charms and hexes, they are still very dangerous. All they did was really fart on me and show me their asses, so they don't seem that dangerous. Yeah, I'm going to have to go back to them because... I won't be able to get past there. It looks like I have to kill these guys first, which is fine. Did you find anything? Yeah. Whoa, wait, what are they doing? Oh, Harry's just... <laughs> Harry, why are you being sus? <laughs> and then Ron's just like, I need to crab walk away from this, but I can't. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Oh well, right, let's open the door for them then, so Ron can kill these Jigglypuffs. <laughs> Jigglypuffs. Brilliant. Shut up, Ron. I'm trying, but it won't let me climb the damn thing. 
Thanks, Hermione. Shut up, saved us. Yeah, from your complete glitch. Yeah, nice one. I hope this means we can all get out of here now. All right, Ronald Weasley. It's like the old song. Oh. Okay, I guess you want to target that one then. You're in the way. Oh my god. <laughs> How is it just not doing anything? Stop running away! Oh god, I hate these things so much! <laughs> Why? Why does it target the other things? I'm going to save after this because I hate these guys so much. <sighs> Is anything down here? It looks like I could drop down. No, just to my death, I think. Wait. No, there really is nothing down there. I'm saving. <laughs> Those things are so buggy. I really feel like I don't make much progress in these episodes. <coughs> me. Damn. The goes on tight. I'm just allergic to bullshit. What are those things? Red cows! Don't you read anything? <laughs> Run doesn't Oh, these are different versions, okay. Well, it looks like I'm gonna have to reflect stuff. Okay. So it looks like I might have to wait for those guys to charge. Charge! I didn't even go through the door and it's a loading screen. How weird. We'll stay here. Go through the exit without being seen and your friends will follow you. It looks like I can search this or something. I don't know, maybe not then. Is it... There's really nothing to hide from. Honestly, I much prefer these um, things to prefects. <gasps> oh, God. Oh, okay. Well, it's time to stock up on some of these portions. I wonder how many you can hold. Okay. Ah! There is a prefect! Oh my god! <gasps> Go away, prefect! He's just like, I'm end this man's whole career. <sighs> oh, I fucking hate prefects. Please don't be any more actual prefects, because they fucking suck. I wonder if you lose house points in this game for being caught. Can I just sneak behind him? Nope. Uh-oh. Please don't get caught. Oh my god. How did that even happen? How the... How? 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 I hate night times. And it's not over. 
please don't be any real prefects. I hate real prefects. There's gotta be real prefects. I'm saving. I I hate night times. I I've always hated night times. It's like it's like a deep rooted fear because of my childhood playing Chamber of Secrets. The Chamber of Secrets, Night Times, and Prefects is just absolutely horrifying to me. And on it, like, I think it probably also leads to, like, um, my general fear now of being caught. Like, being caught, like, I, I could never just, like, sneak around somewhere in real life because of this. Like, that primal fear of just being caught just scares the absolute shit out of me. <sighs> Alright. I don't see any prefects. There's usually like three prefects walking around here in the previous game. Thanks, <gasps> oh my god, that scared really me. Saved us. <laughs> oh, I just remembered. We still haven't got any grap horn horn for Snape's potions class tomorrow. Wait, yes I do. Um, Hermione? Yeah, it was in my inventory, but I don't know how I have it. Where did you... Draco. He dropped it. Nice! We what? looted Draco. You're amazing. There's more than enough for everyone here. Let's all turn in. I'm worn out and I really could do with a good sleep. Yes, let's. Can I just end it here? I really don't... Yeah, end there. I am not walking around Hogwarts at night time. Okay. I wonder what this Lord is to Hogwarts. The sky lightened Winter? into a dazzling opaline white, and the muddy grounds were hidden beneath a blanket of soft snow. Inside the castle, there was a buzz of Christmas in the air. <gasps> Christmas. Marred only by worries over Professor Snape's imminent potions class. Well, we got the grout horn horn, but last time I checked, we were still missing some of the other ingredients. Yeah, all of them. We better go and find them before we go to Snape's class then. Well, there's a few things I do wonder, and that's if I can still go to Hagrid's class and complete that full, like get an or like complete it actually, because I it would have been very easy to get those twenty bats. That Draco Malfoy really gets on my nerves. Yeah. Do you think Hagrid might know about Chiz Purples? Chiz Purples? Hello there. Hello, Hermione. So, let's hand this in, because we finally found it. Return item. Ten house points. Ten house points. Okay. What the hell? See if Hagrid can help us. So I knew there was a thing here by last episode. I was like, hey, look, on the mini map, there's a green thing, and Ron can actually just open it. That's nuts. Great. Great. Ron doesn't give a fuck about reading. Also, I just found out today that need to get some the um that Do you think Hagrid can help? the Anixia wipe animation was removed by YouTube after 13 years, which really sucks. Like, it's a classic video of the um, World of Warcraft, and it's the animation uh, someone made of... Basically, they fight a boss called Anixia, and, like, YouTube just removed it for it being, like, violent, which doesn't make any sense, because it's just... Like, if, really if, if the fire. Anixia wipe animation is violent, then surely fighting Anixia is violent. Like, playing World of Warcraft is violence, right? So surely all World of Warcraft videos should just be taken down from YouTube. Like, it just doesn't make any sense. There's clearly maybe some kind of grudge that's happened or something. But that Anixia wipe animation should not have been taken down. And the original owner, he edited out, like, some swear words some and stuff and re-uploaded it. Do you think Hagrid can help? Um, and that's the upload now. And it really sucks. Like, YouTube is just... There's something going on with YouTube, and it it's not a sustainable place to be if 
All you want to do is play some games and say shit, fuck, piss and cunt. And of course, like even saying that is just the AI will just get you my video now and just be like, person. not show it to as many people and stuff because you just swear. It like it's just how it works these days. But like YouTube, they have. I know this has no place in a Harry Potter video, but they have a kids app. They have YouTube Kids. So why would they give a shit about people swearing? Like. It, it doesn't... And it's all automated these days as well. There's no real Where people involved in this priority? shit. Anyway, so let's see what we're missing. I remember all. Last seen near the stone circle in the grounds. If found, please return to noise bar. Okay, so I need to go to the grounds and find a stone thing. But that'll be the end of this episode anyway. <sighs> that was a weird rant at the end. But it's just something that's on my mind. And it really does just suck the way things are going. Where... Oh yeah, I also let's read my thing real quick first. Because Ron just found that page. I almost forgot about it because I was just ranting. Yeah, I wondered where it came from. I was like, where did it come from? And I even looked it up. The grap horn horn. <laughs> Alright. Let's see what we're missing. Uh, what we've got here. A troll? No, it can't be the troll. I'm sure I read troll before. Yeah, yeah, well, that's what it is. A troll is a fearsome creature up to 12 feet tall and weighing over a ton. That's very heavy. Notable for its equally prodigious strength and stupidity, trolls are particularly attracted to unpleasant smells. Well, they'll be they'll be very attracted to my cat's farts then, because my cat's farts stink. Okay, well, that was an interesting episode. We'll try and get back around to a few things we did in this episode in the future and see how that turns out for us. <sighs> so thanks for watching and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye.